Welcome to this remote technical corner. Today we're going to be discussing the Paisler Rotary Table Range from Brown and Holmes. And I have the pleasure to be joined by Kevin Ward, Managing Director of Brown and Holmes. Welcome, Kevin. Hi, Gio. Good to see you. And you, Kevin, I'm, I'm glad uh, that you could join us for this technical corner. Now, you've recently um, acquired the Paisler Rotary Table range to your portfolio of products. Can you firstly just give us a, a technical overview of the product range, please? Um, the product range itself is the fourth and fifth axis um, configuration additions to standard three axis machine. Nice compact units that um, Paisley manufacture, very accurate, very good um, uh, torque capacity as regards to rigidity under machining, which we liked. The design's very, very cute as regards the uh, level of uh, adjustment and uh, service and maintenance you can give it to prolong its life which we very much liked. And uh, it sits very, very nicely alongside Brown and Holmes' core product, which is obviously design and manufacture of work on it. Now, Kev, there's, there's a lot of fifth axis technology out in the market. Why would somebody, or an engineer especially, look to invest in a, a fourth or a fifth axis rotary table rather than buying a fifth axis machine? I think price is obviously the main driver. I mean, from our own point of view, we've got two machine shops now, normally full of three-axis CNC machines, which are uh, various size and what have you. And uh, we do a level of component manufacture within the business to complement the, the manufacture of work on it. And we're seeing more complex components chucked at us and uh, to stay competitive we need those extra axes really and uh, we can't just go out in the market although we have just purchased a five axis machine i'm delighted to say but um it, commercially it's a damn sight easier and a damn sight quicker for us to adapt the machinery that we have got which is still in good perfect working order and it's obviously sorry sorry Jim, but it's obviously it's it's helping us uh, reduce setup times and produce components even for within our, uh, the manufacture of our fixtures uh, quicker and probably more accurately than we, than we had before. So effectively, Kev, is it right to say that it's adding value to your machine tool? Yeah, without doubt it is. It's certainly, you know, as I said, purely on the cost down, on reducing setups and even being able to uh, produce various forms within a component that previously we were unable to uh, to achieve so yes definitely now what kind of accuracy can you expect from this range i know it's a high quality uh rotary table it's german manufactured i believe yeah it is Pfizer are based they have two sites in germany we know about the dusseldorf area we've got a wide range of in, in size of these units which um yeah, which, which I think is very attractive and, and, and sits very nicely with the, the, the more popular size of machine, three axis machines that uh, seem to be out there. Um, but yeah, accuracies. Yeah, we're talking microns as regards repeatability. Um, um, the most impressive thing for me really is the level of torque as regards to the, how hard you can hit the component held on these units and you're getting no deflection. What? what I'll say no deflection, that's impossible. Well, within a couple of microns, maximum deflection. And I'm talking about on roughing out cuts, and I'm talking 40 millimetre depth of cuts on a 20, 30, 40 millimetre diameter cutter. So, yeah, very, very rigid and, uh, yeah, quality equipment and, and very competitive with price for, the, for what they did. Yeah, you would assume price was, would have been one of my next questions, Kev. You, you would assume with a quality German product such as the, the Paisler product range, there would be a, a large price tag, but that you've just mentioned that's not the case. So definitely come and inquire about that. You mentioned rigidity. Does the rigidity come from the casting of the rotary table? No, the rigidity really comes from the uh, from the actual design, the actual gear complex within within the units. There's there's a very clever three 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 part three piece worm gear assembly, which is um, 
which really is the crux of the accuracy and the rigidity of, of, of these units. And it's, uh, as I said just previously, that three-part setup allows adjustment through the lifetime. So the lifetime of these units carefully looked after and, and properly used is, 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 is incredible. We're talking many years. So for end users that are looking to buy a brand new machine or for existing end users that have got existing machines that are a few years old, how easy is the interface of these rotary tables? Very easy. The, the, the motors, I said, we, we like the fact that they, that they offer different motors which are compatible and different drives which are compatible to all the machine tools that we come across, certainly from our supply of, of work on. You know, so there's not an issue there in regards interfacing with the control systems that are out there on, on the majority of the uh, machine tool suppliers. And with an organisation like yourselves, Kev, I would assume that you'll be doing the installations as well. Yeah, installations, um, service and uh, repair of the units as well, which you'll be offering from the UK. And uh, there's, there's other products that um, Paisler um, manufacture, of which there are numerous in the UK and Ireland, which we're planning to offer service and support for as well from our facility in Tamworth. Now, I believe that you have pneumatic and hydraulic clamping options with these tables is that correct that's absolutely correct yeah yeah there's uh, the most versatility there as regards the, uh, the control of these units now you're a very technical outfit at brown and holmes and some of the specialized fixtures that you make for rolls royce for example are out of this world now okay. does this complement your product range so for example kev if a client came to you and wanted, wanted a bespoke fixture, say for a, a trunnion assembly, for example, is this the kind of uh, work that you could be looking to win, having this product in your portfolio? Yeah, I think the products that we've, we've accumulated around ourselves, Poison's no, no different, Gio, that uh, we're, we're trying to... I don't know, be that one-stop shop for our customers, take the problems away from the guys and basically let them come to Brown and Holmes and we'll, we'll supply the full solution rather than having to shop around. But, uh, yeah, I mean, some of our customers have their favoured sources of supply, but we, we just wanted to give that, that, that little bit extra as regards our scope of supply and, and just taking all the problems away and just go to Brown and Holmes for the complete solution. So, effectively, Kev... Clients can come to you, buy the rotary tables as a standalone product to add value to their machine tools. Or if they were after a turnkey package, which included a fourth or fifth axis rotary table, that's also not a problem. And you would project manage that for them. Absolutely, Gio. Yeah. Yeah. So, Kev, thank you very much for your time. It's been great to get an insight into the Paisler rotary tables and some of the technical aspects that make this product a very quality an accurate product. How should people get in touch to find out more? The website, our website normally gives all the contact information. Um, yeah, uh, there's, there's uh, direct access to put an inquiry through that website. Phone numbers are there and uh, all our email addresses as well. So yeah, pick up the phone, email us or use the web inquiry form.